Hello everyone, today we shall discuss the difference between PIR and IR sensors. PIR stands for Passive Infrared Sensor, which is a sensor that uses infrared technology to remember the infrared image of the surrounding area and notices any changes, which would be caused by motion. An IR sensor is an infrared sensor, which is a sensor that uses infrared technology, chips in a transmitter to determine whether the light that the transmitter is emitting is from an object or a person. This is also good for security purposes, their main differences include, the IR sensors detect whether the light from the transmitter is emitted by an object or a person. Whereas, the PIR sensors detect changes in the levels of energy around the area. If the PIR sensor is installed towards the changing environment, it may let off a false alarm due to the change in the way the air flows, however, IR sensors must be installed facing the motion. IR sensors are usually only installed on the outside of properties, whereas PIR sensors are usually installed inside. PIR sensors don't actually emit the infrared, objects give the sensor infrared rays. This differs from IR sensors, which do actually infrared. What is a passive infrared sensor? A passive infrared sensor, also known as a PIR sensor, is used in automatic doors or gates to detect when to open or close them. These sensors use infrared technology to detect a change in the energy around the surrounding area. The sensor itself remembers the usual energy level using an infrared camera and will detect when there is a change, which is caused by people or objects. When a change is detected, the automatic gates or doors will open. As soon as the change in the energy level has gone back to normal, the doors will close. These sensors should always be installed facing away from the surrounding areas. This is because the change in the pressure of the airflow will affect the detection. This will cause the gates to open, without anyone or anything actually being there, and due to the weather change, this could happen frequently throughout the day. This type of infrared sensor is known as passive as it doesn't actually emit infrared. Instead, the object or person will emit infrared to the sensor, which causes the change in the energy level. How do automatic doors use PIR? The infrared camera will show the surrounding area, and the sensor will remember this image. They are usually installed facing away from the surroundings, as the weather can affect the detection, and create false alarms, meaning your automatic door will open and close without needing to. When the sensor detects a change in the energy level, which is caused by someone or something moving, it will send a signal to the automatic doors, and trigger them to open. When the sensor no longer detects the change in the energy level, the automatic doors will close, this is brilliant for security purposes, as it means that whenever there is someone or something outside, or near your property, the PIR sensor will pick it up. The sensor works by detecting an energy change, which happens when the human body reacts with infrared technology. If you want to find out more advice about the PIR sensors, and how they are used for automatic doors, then please get in touch with a professional. They will be able to answer any of your queries and questions and point you in the right direction. What is an infrared beam motion sensor? Infrared beam motion sensors are another type of sensor that uses infrared technology. They send out of a beam of light which can detect when someone or something moves past it. You may not be able to see the light as you pass it, as the further away you are from it, the fainter it becomes. When installing your infrared beam motion sensors, you must make sure that nothing is blocking the lights, as this could either stop them from detecting anything, or it could cause the sensors to keep making false alarms. The sensors have a long range, but you must position them to ensure they will be able to detect the motion nearest to your property. These types of sensors are brilliant for security purposes, as they can pick up motion from the ground and upwards, as long as you position them in the right way. They can be beneficial to use for automatic doors and gates if necessary, as when the beam senses motion, this will send a signal to the doors, causing them to open. How do automatic doors use infrared? Automatic doors use infrared through the sensors used to open and close the doors. When the passive infrared sensors detect a change in the temperature, which is caused by the human body, the sensors will send a signal to the automatic doors to open. There are two types of infrared sensors used in automatic doors, known as active and passive infrared sensors. They are a very popular choice as they can be perfect for security and protection purposes for your property. The active infrared sensors use light from the transmitter to detect whether the motion is coming from an object or a person. The beam of light is mostly faint, so it is hard to see. In automatic doors, once the beam of light detects someone walking through it, it will send a signal to the automatic door to open. It is important to install infrared sensors in the right way, exactly, as the positioning is key. Otherwise, the sensors may be picking up change in the weather. Also, something from a distance that isn't coming to your property. I hope you found it informative, have a great day.